Hey YouTube, we got on showing you my outfit of the day. Lulu, 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 Adidas, NMDs. This is usually kind of my outfit as things get warmer. I literally wear a sports bra everywhere with like a Lulu Define jacket. I don't know, I just think it's so cute. I could work out if I wanted to, I could run errands, but just going to a doctor's appointment right now, which I'll talk to you guys a little bit about in the car. In here getting my biopsy. See if I have an autoimmune disease. I don't know if it's gonna hurt or not. They put like needles in my throat. <laughs> So, I'll check with you guys after. You can actually see the needle hole. Can you guys see that? You can see where a freaking needle went in. Mm. Stop by Sonic, got a diet cherry limeade. 20 calories for this whole thing. It tastes so bomb. Anyways, just wanted to show you guys. Little needle hole. Love that for us. I'm like, I'm really stiff. It kind of hurts to move around and it's really inflamed. It, I don't really like talking or swallowing or. I think when you're watching this, it's the next day. I just got back from the gym. And for those of you who don't know, I live in Arizona and it's about 110 degrees outside right now. So I'm getting torched. I don't have sunscreen on, so I don't know why I did that. Why did I do that? I don't know. I definitely stay out here for longer than I should. I stay out here for like sometimes two hours or so. I'll like get a little jump rope or I'll do some abs, but it's freaking hot. Anyways, tanning, relaxing, got a book with me. I'll check in with you guys later. Later alligator. Bye. Little post workout, post tan facial going down. If you guys haven't got this stuff off Amazon, this like healing Indian clay, oh my gosh, best stuff ever for your skin. Mix it with some apple cider vinegar, makes like the best, I, I my skin clears up like right away, even though I have bad skin. But there's a huge difference, I definitely recommend it. So, leave it on for like 10 minutes and after this, I'm gonna try and take a nap. I can't tell you the last time I took a nap. It was probably the day I quit playing softball. That's a good story. The day I quit playing softball, I came home, came to my uh, dorm, took a three hour nap, passed out. It was just so much like release. It felt so good. That's probably honestly the last time I took a nap. I just, I'm not a napper. Probably because I <laughs> drink coffee. What's up, YouTube? We're back, baby. We're hitting Old Town tonight. First night back after quarantine. Me and Paige, wherever she is, we're hitting the streets. We're getting tacos. It's going to be delicious. I don't know what I'm getting. Haven't looked at the menu. Usually I do kind of go in with an idea of what I'm going to get, but I'm not even sure if we're getting tacos. So this is kind of just spontaneous. We're going to meet up with some friends, show you guys the food, See y'all later. Hey vlog, last you saw me, I think we're getting ready to go out to dinner with some friends and it's the next day. And with those same friends, we're going on a little hike. You know, they just moved to Arizona and they don't understand that. It's hot as balls at like 10 a.m., okay? It's like 110 degrees out. They're gonna die. I'm along for the ride to just be for moral support. And I'll catch you guys on the trail. Anything you wanna add, Paige? I'm scared. I also want to add that I got Starbucks and my go-to drink is cold brew with two or three pumps of skinny mocha. It's like five calories a pump or something like that. And then I'll add two Splenda. Delicious people. Just had a little pit stop. Everyone say hi. Wave. What up? Hello. <laughs> They're all dying. We've never done this trail. What? Yeah, it's pretty toasty out here. I've never done I'm this hike. Right now from this. If you guys are in Arizona, we're at a Squaw Peak. Is that what Squaw, it's called? Yeah. Squaw Peak. We're very sweaty. We got our fanny packs though. Sticky. Update, we're about uh, 10, 15 minutes from the top. We think. <laughs> up there. We've been, we've been told. <laughs> we've been told, so. <laughs> See, it's tough. Hey guys, we made it to the top. Kind of bad, but not too bad, honestly. Now that I look back on it, it wasn't that bad. Wasn't that bad. Our friends are still, uh, down there, but we uh, trooped up to the top. Hello, YouTube. We're back. Finished with the hike. I didn't think it was that bad. 
lot, but now that I'm sitting in the car, it's like setting in how freaking tired I am. And what about you, Paige? Nap time? Uh, me and Aiden were. Me and one of the guys mom. held the group out in front. These guys are a little, little dragon over here. It's okay, hey, we made it. That's all that matters. Better late than never. You know, shower. Hair washing day. We love that day. This is day four that washing my hair, not gonna lie. Yeah. Yesterday I just jumped in the pool. Honestly, it's good for it. Yeah, it is good for it. It's good to get the oils going. Anyways, yeah, I'm beat right now. I'm so tired. Me too. Nap time, smoothie time, shower time. Lake tomorrow. And then we're going to lake tomorrow. I'm so hungry. I just got back from like a little pool party with some friends and I'm just sitting on my ground, still in the bathing suit, eating some Chipotle. So freaking hungry. It's like 6.30. I hadn't eaten since 1.00. I have one meal to do before this. I'm starving. But yeah, we I hiked the mountain this morning with some friends. And then one of my other friends, I don't know why I'm so social today. One of my other friends is like, come to a pool party with me and my other friends. And I was like, you know what? Let's just make this an extroverted day. Let's just be social. Might as well meet some friends. And I went and it was really fun. But now I'm freaking starving and ready to be introverted, be in a little cave, got the ambiance going, and get to editing. But yeah, definitely gonna stay in Saturday night. Very social today. We're going to the lake tomorrow. Shall be fun. Good, it's not bad. You two tattoos on both legs? And then he's got another one by his elbow. He did all three of them. Yeah, let's go. Fire me up. Hey YouTube, good morning. It is about 10.30 in the morning, Monday morning, and I just want to give you guys a little weekend recap. I actually did a lot and I was really social, kind of weird. Friday I went to dinner with friends, a friend group. That was super fun. We literally sat at the table for like two and a half hours, just like life chatting, which is you know, it's always nice to have that friend group where you can just life chat, you know, it's not surface level. And then we woke up the next morning in that same group. We all went for a hike and that took a few hours, super hot. We went on like the hottest part of the day. And then after that, I, with another friend group, I went to a pool party, which was so random. So yeah, I went hiking and then went to a pool party. So that was Saturday. And Sunday we woke up and that same friend group we went hiking and dinner with, we went to the lake. We had a lake, like a lake day. We were there for so long. We were there from like eight or nine till five. It was just a whole day. That was so much fun. I'm freaking, I'm really, I actually got some color. I'm not pale. This is the one summer where I actually have some color to me. So <laughs> thank God. I always look better in clothes when you're tan. So I'm not mad about it. I'm sure like my skin hates it and wrinkles hate it, but I just want one summer to myself. Yeah, I am sitting in the gym parking lot hopping myself up not gonna lie we swam forever yesterday and so i'm pretty beat i'm planning on just doing a little recovery jog or something it's already 98 degrees out so nothing too crazy i'm pretty tired just get a little sweat and i'll check in with you guys with my meal post workout because i'm still fasted so show you guys my meal and bye hello youtube i'm back and i didn't show you my post-workout dinner or my post-workout meal but i'll show you my dinner so hopefully this makes up for it it it's a big look at that bowl that's a big bowl usually i have like a big salad for dinner i had a lot of like i feel really heavy and so i just wanted something light so i made a salad so i have a bed of greens spinach shredded lettuce then we have roasted air fried vegetables. We have mushrooms, bell peppers, butternut squash, and broccoli and broccoli. And then ground beef, topped it with some mangoes, which adds so much flavor. I just started doing that and it's so good. And then I topped it, I'll post the pretty picture of what it looks like, but cause here I've topped it with nutritional yeast and like tomato, basil, garlic seasoning, something like that. Um, so yeah, this is dinner. If I see you guys in another clip, I'll see you in another clip. Good morning, YouTube. As you can see, I'm on a trail run right now. And I'm really tired, so I thought I'd procrastinate by talking to you guys. Because I just ran up a hill. And I can't breathe. Yeah, out here, 
I usually do this like three times a week ish. It's just nice to instead of running on like a pavement in the canal, it's kind of nice to just like run some hills and trail running is different than running on just flat ground. You have to focus, try not to roll your ankle the whole time. It makes time go by a lot faster. It's 745 right now. I just out here for like 45 ish minutes. It's usually like my activity for the day and then I'll maybe get a lift in later. Oh, it's Tuesday, by the way. It's Tuesday morning. So I think this vlog is going to cut off here. I'll wrap it up when I get back in the car. And I will see you guys, yeah, in the car. Along with my trail run, I usually come to this little staircase. It's kind of cool. It's like a little theater. And I'll run up these stairs a few times, do a couple like burpees on the steps. Just as a little bear break in between my, my run. All right, just wanted to show you guys what I do for my trail run. I'll trail run, do some stuff, and then I'll continue my trail run and I'll finish it. So, cause you guys wanna look a little better and can breathe. Hey YouTube, so I hope you enjoyed a little snapshot into my life. Last few days, I think I started this vlog on Thursday and now it's Tuesday morning. It's like 10.30 Tuesday morning. I went for a little hike this morning, just get some cardio, blood flowing. I'll probably hit the gym this afternoon for a little something. Just feeling like it. Why not? Nothing nothing really else to do with curfew and quarantine. But I don't know when I'm going to put this vlog up. It just really doesn't seem like the appropriate time. I just encourage you all to educate yourself. I think that's first and foremost. Um, you can't really take a stance on anything if you're undereducated and ignorant on a subject. So hopefully in a year we can look back on this and something good will be taken away. That's all I can just cling to. I've cried and I can only hope that something good's taken away from this. Or else what's it all for? So I love you guys, all of you, always. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.